actually write first thing in the morning for an hour just because I like to make time for that every day and then I moved on to actually doing studying. So I started off by doing some reading for my adaptations module, which I was going to take, but I ended up changing my module. So I did all the pre-work for it, but I've actually dropped that module now and I'm taking a Victorian literature module instead, which I am so much more excited for. And I know I'm going to love this module. I'm thoroughly excited, but this reading was still so interesting. We were looking at The Mask of the Red Death by Edgar Allan Poe and adaptations of this um, and what's called the Poe cycle which is basically the idea that in the 1960s Poe became recognized as part of the classical literary canon and this was partially to do with film adaptations and kind of as a marketing ploy the directors and producers really played up how canonized Poe was when actually he wasn't that established in the literary canon. T.S. Eliot actually described his intellect as that of a quote highly gifted young person before puberty quote uh, which is quite interesting so he wasn't actually respected as much as I thought he was but films and adaptations of certain stories served to change that so uh, this reading was kind of going into that in a bit more depth and I use my iPad to read this and circle anything important and maybe make some annotations on the side and then I would just go and type up notes on my laptop into Notion. Then I watched the Victorian lectures. I swear there were like four hours worth of lectures for this week. They were so good. Oh my gosh, I loved them. So then in the evening after watching my lectures, I decided to bake a vegan jam oli poli because this is my mom's favorite. I was kind of experimenting with Victorian recipes. And then in the evening we watched Enola Holmes. That was my mum and I, and we watched it at the same time as my cousin and auntie. So we were just sending messages through as we were watching it. Yeah, so that was really good fun. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you have a productive week.